So, I asked you guys whether I should spend all my boss keys killing nightmare bosses, or killing the normal variants for gems instead. And you suggested the latter. So here we are. This is loot from 5000 normal emerald kills with a drop rate of 15. But first, some quick math. One kill, including the looting part afterwards, took me about 12 seconds on average. So 5000 kills at 12 seconds each means that it took about 60,000 seconds or a thousand minutes in total, which equals 16.6 hours of grinding. But it's actually super AFKable if you have auto loot. Just enable auto attack and your character will run towards the boss and attack it as soon as it spawns. There was just one problem. With this amount of drop rate, the number of drops that have to spawn in after each kill takes too long, so auto loot stops working for the last few drops. Thus they had to be looted manually anyway, which kinda sucked. But enough of that, here's all the loot I got from the grind. It was really easy to track the kills, since Amarok will always drop a desert topaz, and as you can see, here they are. I ended up with a bit over 3600 gems, which really came in handy now with all the new gem shop upgrades that was added for the new world 6 skills. It wasn't enough to buy every upgrade that I wanted, but it's a good start, so I'm happy. But back to the rest of the boss loot. I also got two beautiful stacks of statues that I will be saving in my storage until I have all statues in the Onyx tier again. Both the golden numb witches and the mystery upgrade stones are used for upgrading stamps, so those will also come in handy. Other than that, I also managed to find myself 6 lucky lads that will be added to my collection and hopefully turn into a third luckier lad eventually. Anyway, this might give you an understanding of what to expect from an Amarok grind like this. It will take some time, but it's a reliable source for gems and other useful materials, so I would say it's worth it. Hope you enjoyed this video, and as always, thanks for watching.